We check in now on the latest cattle market news with our market update brought to you by Cattle Facts. Hello, I'm Marcus Bricks with the Cattle Facts update. The USDA all fresh retail beef price for August was $5.79 per pound. This is just one cent higher than the August 2016 all fresh price at $5.78 and three cents cheaper than the July price. Although year-over-year -year prices are close to equal in last month's data, retail beef prices have been mostly lower in 2017. January to August, retail prices have averaged $5.65 per pound compared to $5.78 per pound in 2016. The record high all-fresh retail beef price was $6.10 a pound in June of 2015. Prices this year have been between 5 to 10 percent less than the highs. Beginning in 2016, retailers had been pursuing a margin incentive in order to move larger per capita protein supplies through stores. The result is, while their input costs have declined in the past two years, retail sales have been maintaining firm prices. The composite cutout, an average measure of wholesale beef prices, totaled $191.73 per hundredweight last week. This is a 26% decline from the 2015 peak, and has the cutout making up 33% of the retail beef price today. This number is the second lowest for the year, and considered low against the five-year average cutout ratio at 38.2% of the retail beef price. Fed prices are also struggling to regain leverage, targeting leverage ratios similar to last fall's lows. Last week, Fed steer prices brought an average price of $105.86 per hundredweight, which is 38% lower than the 2015 market high. 2016 leverage ratios saw Fed prices a percent of all fresh retail reach an all-time low of 15.8% in October. As of last week, Fed as a percent retail equaled 16.4% versus a 22% average and seasonally can still underperform into the fall. It's clear in the data from both the relative price declines from the highs and in the leverage ratios that the retailer is still in command of the margins today. Until there are some major changes to either packing plant capacity or market concentration of retail, the cattle feeder will be locked in an uphill battle for their share of dollars spent on beef. The Angus Report and Cattle Facts, I'm Marcus Briggs. To learn more about Cattle Facts, your leading source for beef industry market information, visit cattlefacts.com.